Hello everyone, welcome to the Christmas in July and it is hosted by Scrap Diva Designs. So go and check out ScrapDivaDesigns.com. These are all her social media outlets and I am going to show you today on this video, as you guys know, it is the Christmas in July. Now we are going to have a series of channels joining us today and everyone will be listed down below. Now the design team has been working on all kinds of Christmas inspiration for you guys to use. So I invite you to hop on over to the design team's channels and every single person will be listed down below. Uh, there's about 15, 16 channels to check out so much so you guys can fill up on your Christmas uh, crafty um, inspiration. So I want to show you the collection I use for my project. It is a candy cane lane and this collection here inspired me uh, to create and I don't know I, I went I have a lot of Christmas collections by the way but I don't know this this one called me and um, and I created some cute items using this collection and um, of course it has the pinks the reds and the greens and I love 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 it so the dies that I use today are gonna include the new the new arrivals which are gonna be available August the first guys get ready and um, be tuned so the first one that i'm going to show you is this one here and this one is the 3d embellishment book yes i use this one to make the uh, 3d my christmas project and then also i use this one here which is the triple star bow i mentioned it in the previous video with the unboxing of the august release that i was going to use that um, on this project also these that i did mention and without further ado let me show you what i created oh my gosh she is so beautiful oh yes she is of course she has a dangle of course she has a dangle so this is the embellishment book that it will be out august the first but look how super sturdy it is and it comes with all these matting pieces you don't have to measure it already automatically comes out all you have to do is run it through your machine put it together and then create this beauty but let me dive in uh to what i did and what is on this project the first thing is this bow yes this bow you guys already seen this bow there and um it is the large one from from the star bow that will come out august the first as well as the um lowercase letters here i pop them on foam and add it to the spine the die does come with this scallop edge here how beautiful it is and it looks so using the co paper collection i just matted my book some beautiful trim on here that i have on, in my stash as well as this ribbon here and in the front added a dangle and some of my items that I have in my stash that my friends made for me. For example, this pincetia here was made by my friend Denise. And this one was made by Gloria. This one was made by V Morales, which is a buzzing with V. So a V I used. She stitched on this, by the way, guys. She did that. I didn't. Okay. <laughs> so um, I used her beautiful snowflake uh, layered piece here. Added a little, a little trim here and there. And then the back piece right here is a piece of trim that my friend Sele, she gifted me uh, for my birthday. And so there she is uh, in, in the background there and added the peppermints. I mean, this collection is so beautiful. I love, love, love it. And then just added a piece of ephemera right there with some gems. You know, guys, I love my gems. So they are everywhere and the dangle here. Now, I did forget to put some of my charms on here and I will add charms. But for the purpose of this video, I just want to show you, you know, what I made with the Scrap Diva Design dies. And so I'm just going to open this baby up. I created a pocket on the first page when you open this beautiful album, this 3D album, and added acetate as you guys see there and on this first pocket added some cut aparts and some tags that i just added here now the recipient can use this as a keepsake book and add some pictures on the, the back and further decorate if they'd like but i went ahead and added that pocket on here i just decorated it simply with the ephemera and on the other side 
another pocket with some tags how beautiful does that look i love 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 it and um on the front here it's is bow applique look how cute it looks and inside, so let me open it and so you guys could see. And inside, I love giving you guys a, a size reference. So I added this here. You could add a little trinket box. You could add a sequin mix. I mean, it's just, it's super roomy. So let me put this to the side. I'll bring it back right now at the end so we could uh, see how much, how much room it has. So inside, I made, using the popcorn uh, box, I made this cutie here. Look how cute she is. I didn't add anything here, but I do plan to add something here. Um, but for the for the most part, I use the ephemera pieces, the pincetias, and look how cute. All these la layering pieces do come with the die. There's another one of those bows that will be available August the 1st. And look how beautiful this little book is. It's the perfect, imagine adding a little junk journal to your embellishment book, an embellishment box. I mean, you guys could do whatever you like. I'm gonna show you right now that an actual embellishment box fits there that's why i have this box right here next to me and so what i did is just add a little pockets with tags then um added some of the ephemera with a paper clip there went ahead and added some bows so the recipient can use them on their projects and then here added some lace with some more cut aparts look how cute this is with the lace there and then the last page here i added some of the flowers that were handmade by uh, a crafty friend and then I, on this little pocket it's a little Santa tag that my friend Denise made for me so I added it here so I could be able to share it with someone but look how beautiful that is I mean after the recipient takes everything out they could add this and make it an album add their own little pages further decorate it and make it theirs so look how beautiful this is this is just the perfect size to fit inside of this beautiful um 3d embellishment to my book how beautiful so let us fit a embellishment this is a let me let me um measure it for you this one measures six and a quarter by five and a quarter with this little ridge right here and look how perfectly it fits inside here look how cute that is and then you can further put your embellishment on um, box here of course you are going to put it inside a cellophane bag you can add a, add a card and a little pen there and then close it up and look how cute it looks with the embellishment box in there oh my gosh this is so perfect you could add whatever you like to this embellishment book box how beautiful did this project turn out I am loving the red, the candy cane. It's just so perfect. Then we are going to put back my little embellishment book. So I'm going to put it facing this way. Add my pen. Add my little shaker mix right here in the front. Of course, I'm going to add more items to this, like a card. Possibly another little dangle onto that sequin mix there. This is my project. Go follow the next person on this Christmas in July hop hosted by ScrapDivaDesigns.com and check out um, the next one in line which is Strawberry Cream 39 which is Jen and if you stayed so far I'm gonna make an announcement yes giveaway alert so Erica is so generous that she is she's giving away a $10 gift card and gift card to her shop guys so if you want to be entered into this giveaway that she is so generously um, providing you have to leave a comment okay now in order for you to be eligible you have to like follow and subscribe to all the participating channels in this hop okay and my secret word for you to win this giveaway will be candy cane so leave me a, leave me a comment with the word candy cane and i'm going to enter you into the giveaway for the ten dollar gift card now also the last day to comment to leave your comment will be july 29th and a winner will be announced on the 30th of july so stay tuned guys know that every channel that's um participating in this hop will be giving away a ten dollar gift card so 
go over to each and every one and go and watch their video and um, provide them with what they're asking for and um, and you'll be entered to win a $10 gift card. So thank you so much, Erica, for giving us uh, that $10 gift card. And again, guys, go over to ScrapDivaDesigns.com and use E10. That is my coupon code. You get 10% off your purchase. And I hope this has inspired you. And again, I'm going to mention to you um, that this embellishment book box will be available August the 1st, as well as the bow and a lowercase alphabet. This, this will all be available August the 1st. But as of right now, the popcorn box is available as of right now. So use Eve 10 if you plan to purchase this die here. So that is all for today, guys. Thank you so much for joining me. And I hope you go and you jump on over, or hop on over to the next person and you enjoy this hop that we're having today. Have an awesome day and I will talk to you on the next video. Bye.